break it down. When someone says that they will break it down, they mean that they will explain it step by step in stages in smaller pieces. Let me break it down for you so it's easier to understand, your chemistry teacher might tell the class after nobody understood a new concept. Maybe you're learning the grammar of Japanese but don't quite get it. Could you break it down for me? I need each aspect explained in more detail. Now we'll look at our financials and break it down by department, a chief financial officer might say during an executive meeting. As you can tell, break it down means to take something big or overwhelming and divide it down into smaller, more digestible parts, making it easier to grasp, understand. The origin of the idiom, break it down, is not entirely clear, but according to Google Books Ngram viewer, it rose in popularity at the start of the 1930s. Break it down is perhaps self-explanatory, as you can easily picture a large, huge, gigantic, massive concept being broken down into smaller pieces. The opposite idiom, break it up, is most often used when two people are arguing or fighting and a third person orders them to stop. Okay, kids, break it up or no one gets dessert, a parent might be yelling at their children who are fighting over toys. In life, the goals that you set or the dreams you have might seem insurmountable, impossible, hopeless, because they are too big, too great, colossal, titanic, epic. But all you have to do is break it down into smaller, more manageable chunks. Write your goal or dream down at the top of a piece of paper and estimate how many years you think it'll take. Then, break it down into what you can achieve toward your goal each year, then each month, then each week, then each day. You will find that there are small steps you can take each day in deference to your goal. If you want to achieve something big, you've got to first break it down into small milestones that when combined equal your ultimate goal. Your dad might be giving you advice. Perhaps you're learning music theory. Composing music seems daunting, but if you break it down into its components, it's not so bad. Those components include melody, rhythm, harmony, timbre. I don't quite understand how solar panels turn sunlight into electricity. Can you break it down for me? You might ask your mom after watching a video on renewable energy. So, the next time you're offering to explain something at length, go through the details. Make it more clear. Don't forget to say that you'll break it down.